Police are now investigating whether they're all connected. KPIX 5's Jackie Ward spoke to one man who fought off the suspects with a gun in his face, and she has more from police headquarters. In the span of just 30 minutes, San Francisco police say that three suspects tried carjacking three different vehicles. In each of the cases, one of the suspects showed a gun to the victim. The first attack happened at 9th and Harrison around 2.30 this morning. An Uber driver says he was waiting at a light when three people suddenly charged his car. One was trying to get in the driver's seat with a gun, pointing it at me, and I just kept whacking at the barrel and not letting him, and he kept trying to open my door, and he finally opened it, tried to yank me out, and I just kept fighting him. The driver says he was hit at one point, too, but paramedics checked him out on scene and determined him to be okay. Minutes after the first carjacking attempt, and just a half a block down 9th, police say the same suspect smashed a front window of this car while the driver was parked. They tell us someone smashed their window and the rest is a blur. Having a window broken on you is always really terrifying um, and paralyzing in that feeling. Uh, I am just really glad that I got out of this with a little bit of a cut. A third incident happened moments after that at Mission and DeBose. In all three cases, the suspects were able to escape and the victims didn't get hurt in a major way. Police are saying this is not normal activity. Definitely unusual. Uh, we do experience carjackings throughout the city, but they're not uh, I wouldn't um, say that there's an uptick uh, there. Now, police are collecting footage from nearby businesses whose surveillance cameras may have caught the suspects in action. Police say they do have suspect descriptions, but they are not making that information public. In San Francisco, Jackie Ward, KPIX 5. Police have not said whether the victims are connected in any way.